The continued professionality of Walmart on the road. It symbolizes their dedication to delivering on our promise while prioritizing safety on the road. Pride in Walmart sparks the extend beyond the individual driver, creating an atmosphere of respect and teamwork across the entire enterprise. Welcome back to the Recruiter Call channel. Yo, I am your humble host over here, Lockout Men. I'm coming in with different intros, so just work with me, and I just want to see which one works. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? So check this out. In this edition of the MTC, we're going to be looking at Walmart ah! transportation. And you want to know why we're going to be looking at Walmart transportation? It's because a young man by the name of Allen, he is the talent acquisition partner transportation guy for Walmart. He reached out to me, sent me an email. He says in this. Email, he goes, hey, I'm a Walmart truck driver recruiter for region three. And that is Illinois, Wisconsin, Kansas, Missouri, Iowa, Nebraska, Wyoming, and Colorado. He says, I follow you on YouTube and I find your videos informative. Well, thank you very much, sir. That's what I try to do. I try to bring value over here. I know you talk about the trucking industry and job postings. Yes. Yes, we, we do it all over here. <laughs> he says, if you like, please announce or talk about the Walmart sign-on bonus for our Ot Ot Ottawa, Ottawa, A-T-T-A-W-A, -A, Kansas location. He said last year, Walmart announced our pay increase and stopped the sign-on bonus. But he said, now we are bringing the sign-on bonus back for one location and one location only at this time. He says, Ottawa, Kansas. And, it's, and he says, it starts today as of this email, but today is May 3rd. So I got this email a couple of days ago. So the Walmart sign-on bonus is in effect today. That was May 1st. He says, listen, we are in need. In need. Of 50 new drivers for the Ottawa, Kansas City. So we are doing a 10 thousand dollars let me say that again ten thousand dollars sign on bonus only for that location he says the new driver will get five thousand dollars after they pass the onboarding and another five thousand dollars in six months so within the first year you will get that crisp clean 10k sign on bonus he said that is on top of the 98k through 105k in your first year let's break it down he says what you need to get on with walmart is this he said drivers must live 250 miles within Ottawa, Kansas, or willing to establish a permanent residence within 250 miles within 90 days of employment. So if you like me and live in Ohio and you think that awesome, they'll give you a chance to move out to Ottawa, Kansas, which is not a, what you know, Kansas is not a bad state. It's, it's not a bad state. All right, so let's continue. You must have 30 months of CDL tractor trailer experience within the last four 
years. So that means 30 months, what's that, 24? That means two years and some change. But you got to have that in the last four years. So in other words, you have to be at least driving two and a half years within the four years of you having your CDL. They say, yo, no preventable accidents while operating a commercial vehicle within the last three years. No preventable DOT recordable accidents in the last 10 years. So if you guys was in an accident within a 10 year period, yeah, y'all, y'all, y'all might want to skip this this episode right here. I'm I'm sorry. I'm sorry, but Walmart, Walmart is just as as strict as any other company to get into. But once you in Walmart, though, they say, yeah, you can make some money and you can make a living. A couple of people quit quit Walmart already, but for a handful of people, they like it. No more than two moving violations while operating a personal and commercial vehicle in the last three years. So that means you can't have no red light tickets, speeding tickets, stop sign tickets, no tickets in your personal vehicle. (laughs) They say no serious traffic violations while operating a commercial motor vehicle in the last three years, including cell phones. So let's break it down. Walmart, you guys know Walmart. Y'all see their, y'all see their trucks out here. You see that mega carriers pull for Walmart, but Walmart has their own transportation company as well. Now, I got a question before I continue on. You guys know within the last month that Walmart has been closing down a lot of their stores. My question to the drivers that's already driving for Walmart in those closed stores area, now that they're not on your route no more, how is that affecting you guys? Or is it affecting you guys? Let me know in the comments below. All right. Walmart is a private fleet continuously expanding. We offering a variety of class A driving jobs across the nation in addition to cent per mile we pay drivers for all aspect of the job top talents deserve top pay just more than your miles i agree i agree i mean if you put in the work you put in the loyalty you put in the business you should get top pay walmart cdl a trucking truck driving job this is a regional job you have they have a regional class a driving jobs in over 80 locations across the nation and they are continuously expanding regional truck drivers can preference the schedule options that work best for them and expand security or i'm sorry expect security in their time off every week. Regional truck drivers can earn up to 105K in their first year. Is it true? Let us know in the comments. Here's the benefits. Now they offering the $10,000 sign on bonus only at the one location that I mentioned, that I mentioned previously. Quarterly safety bonus and annual pay increase. No touch freight deliveries. Immediate medical benefit options, including dental, vision, pharmacy, and additional life insurance benefit options from day one. That's what I like. That's what I want. Give me my benefits. That's about the most important thing to me out here is being the truck driver we got to look out for our health man we need a company that's offering that type of benefits give me that 
Don't don't hold back on it. Give me my benefits, man. I need it now. 401k retirement plan and stock purchase program options up to 21 days of PTO. Ask about our Walmart driver's perks, such as our referral program, rider program, driver mentor program, parking at Walmart locations, and more. Now, that's a caveat for you guys. <laughs> if you drive for Walmart, you have no problem parking in their parking lots. None. Period. Now, I don't know for Walmart drivers that drives for companies like U.S. Express, uh, what's that, Mar uh, Mel Mel Melton, some shit like that. I can't remember. Sorry for cussing, but yeah, can't, can't, can't remember. Uh, but if you drive for Walmart, you will not have a problem parking in their parking lots. That's what they're saying. That's part of the program. What you do? Well, of course, you're a CDLA driver. So what are you going to do? You're going to drive. <laughs> you're going to drive within that clock specifications. That's what you're going to do. Why drive for Walmart? Well, let the, you know, we, we want to hear from real Walmart drivers in the comment session. Why drive for Walmart? Because this is canned right here. Why drive for Walmart? Well, stability. Is it stability, though? You know, I mean, I have known some Walmart drivers to quit Walmart because, insert why here, <laughs> uh, they say growth. They say a customer needs to continue growth, so do the career. But how is that growth if Walmart is closing several locations, though? That's what you have to think about. Pride. They said their private fleet drivers are proud to represent the Walmart brand and the continued professionality of Walmart on the road. It symbolizes their dedication to delivering on our promise while prioritizing safety on the road. Pride in Walmart sparks the extend beyond the individual driver creating an atmosphere of respect and teamwork across the entire enterprise. Now, they say if you have this right here, you might be a shoe-in. They said if you have 30 months of previous CDLA experience within the last 48 months and a passion for the open road. They say a safe driving record and continuous dedication to hold up those safety standards, they say if you take pride in your career as a driver and the opportunity to represent the company and the values on the road, commitment to customer service expectations and delivering on time every time. A positive team player with the attitude, with a passion for contributing to the overall success of the Walmart team. All right. So what do you guys think so far? Is is Walmart is is it is it there? Is it there? Are y'all are y'all running to Walmart? Do y'all have the qualifications needed? Oh, and by the way, let me stop the show. As of June 1st of this year, because I seen this in another live feed. As of June 1st, the FMCSA and the clearinghouse is changing the way that they're taking specimens now when you go and do the drug tests. They're giving the employers opportunity to either have you guys to pee in a cup or have your mouth swabbed. Now, peeing in a cup, of course, they got to send it off and then they got to come back with the results. But if they swab your mouth, they can get instant, instant, instant results right then and there. So 
what the FMCSA is now doing, they 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 cutting out the cheaters. Y'all y'all know who y'all are. Y'all know who y'all are, right? Y'all know y'all use y'all kids' uh, pee, you know, kind of put it in a Ziploc bag, kind of tape it up, you know, next to your leg and everything. So when you go in the bathroom, all you got to do is just pour that in the cup and you're good to go. No, 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 no. No more of that. They're going to they gonna sit you right there. They're going to swab your mouth and then put it right then in there and they're going to see right, right off the rip that smoke weed every day. That that's it. You're done. Gotta go. Bye. All right, let's get back at it. <laughs> Minimum qualifications for Walmart. Uh private fleet. I believe that's what this is. The 10K sign-on bonus out of Ottawa, Kansas only. They say a class A commercial driver's license with hazmat endorsement including clear background check or will obtain hazmat endorsement with clear background check within 120 days of the higher date. So to drive for Walmart private fleet, you have to have your hazmat. Now, they're going to give you the opportunity when you come on to get the hazmat. Yes. But you have to have it after 120 days. And they let people know this in the beginning. I'm just saying 30, a minimum of 30 months of experience. Of course, I said that before. No more than two moving violations. I said that before. No serious traffic violations. I said that before. No preventable accidents while operating a commercial vehicle. Said that before. No DLT recordable accidents, said that before. No preventable accidents. Res oh, oh, I didn't say this before. No preventable accidents resulting in a fatality or a catastrophic injury driving history commercial motor vehicle. So I'm not sure. Now, this says preventable. He probably was involved, but it probably might not be your fault. That's what they're saying. And must live, I said this before, within 250 miles of the assigned facility or willing to establish residence within 250 miles. Well, Walmart, shout out to, hold on right quick, let me go back. Got to go back. Shout out to Alan Gaston. Talent acquisition partner, transportation for Walmart. If you guys are interested, the information will be in the description below. You can find Alan at Alan.gaston at Walmart.com. You can get his phone number at 216. I'm sorry, 216. <laughs> Four seven nine three seven one zero six seven one. You can get a hold of them there. I will link the job link and where you can fill out the application in the description below. Well, guys, what do you think? Walmart is is Walmart. A, a lot of you guys are are saying Walmart is the go to, but consider this, okay? Consider everything that's been happening with Walmart within the last couple of months. Make sure you put that in consideration as well. All right, because like I said before. Walmart has been closing stores as of late, and that might put a hindrance on the routes that are available for you new guys that's thinking about Walmart. Now, are you going to make that six figure with Walmart? Maybe, but I know some drivers are making at least five, at least 90, at least 94, 95. And those people that I've talked to has been very pleased with Walmart. So, 
Is Walmart something that you might be interested in? If so, let them know that Lockout Men sent you over there. Say, hey, I saw the video. I like everything that was in the video. Let's see if I can qualify for Walmart. One more thing. Let me stop the show. Walmart is strict with the onboarding. I'm just simply saying they are strict with the onboarding. So it may take more than three days. I heard some onboarding went as far as two weeks. Okay. So just know that. But if you successfully make it through the onboarding, successfully make your first delivery, you'll get that first 5K that's uh, that's coming to you. And if you last for six months, you will get that last 5K. Now listen, don't 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 be a don't be a bonehead and just say, okay, I'm just gonna drive for Walmart for the six months and just take my 10K and bounce. Don't do that. Don't do that. Walmart needs you, man. Walmart needs you, okay? At least give it, you know, even if you don't drive the six months, at least give it a month, at least, to see if it works out for you because Walmart don't work out for everybody. I'm just saying. So, again, information that you guys need will be in the description below. Make sure you check it out. And, and... If any drivers, well, you know what? I shouldn't even say that because I have one particular driver that is in my comment session heavy. I ain't going to mention your name, Colonel. I'm just saying. So if you guys are interested in Walmart and want to know more from a particular driver, Colonel Potts, I can't pronounce his last name or pronounce the last name, but he's always in my comment session. And he's been with Walmart for almost two years. So if you guys have any questions or anything like that, make sure to get with him. But realize the information that I provided is for the Ottawa, Kansas City outlet. And he's out of Texas, I believe. But they probably might still have the same operations. All right. All right. That's going to do it. I appreciate you guys being here with me. Thank you very much for listening. I am your host, Lockout Man, and this is the MTC on the Recruiter Call channel. Until next time, everybody. Who's next? Who's next?